Why is it important not only to participate in a network, but also to contribute? You have to contribute when you're part of a network, partly because that's what a network is, is about. And the reality is, is when you're saying contribute, you're still getting something out of that. For me, it's amazing to hear um, what people are going through. So I've published a book, I've been able to do it you know, fairly well, and I have a lot of people that reach out to me for all different kinds of questions constantly, like, hey, I, constantly people have, I, I have an idea, talk to me about it. And the thing is, is that is giving back. I mean, I'm, I'm more than willing to have conversations with people and help people understand the process, what it is. Um, and there's something about, for me, I found even when I reached out to people, sometimes I just want to hear them. I just want to be close to them because they've done what I want. I had a conversation with them, actually helps me get closer to achieving it. And I think that's, there's always something to gain, you know, when you're, when you're doing that. And for me, I still think when you say contributing, you're still gaining something from that. I get to hear what people are working on, what they're excited about, the challenges they're having, um, and I, I usually learn something from that process. So I don't think of it as, I think it's your responsibility definitely to have that iterative process with people. And if you don't, I just don't think you get nearly as much out of an organization.